Hi, so it's been a while since I opened up a, uploaded a um, sketchbook tour. Um, but this is the fourth sketchbook. This was from the 1st of the 11th to the 25th of the 1st of 2019 to 2021. Um, these are all my stickers. I did these myself. Uh, I'm not selling these or anything. These are all mine. And so are these ones. So this one is the Ilo sketchbook. Um, I was seeing a lot of people buying them, or the people that I watch. And so what I did is that I decided to buy it. And it was a lot. <laughs> I will say that it was a lot. But other than that, um, I wouldn't get it again. Just because of the paper quality wasn't great even though it was advertised as a mixed media. But yeah, so this is my sketchbook. Opening page, uh, self-portrait of myself, sticker, some more portraits of myself and another sticker. Uh, this is of a Twitch streamer known as Nubla underscore 99. He does a lot of Titanfall and Apex stuff. And that's one of his emotes that uh, I just rented up and just made a sticker. And I have sent some to him as well. Uh, pirate stuff <laughs> this is lucky the stout he's a character that i have he's just the companion really um body figures um the stream i was talking about a few characters that i just randomly created and this was the start of me trying out prints so this is glossy paper um from the epson photo uh, glossy paper made a few notes and yeah that's that has been Hotel, Alistair the Radio Demon, and Angel Dust the Spider Demon. OCs of demons that I created for the Has Been World. Some more stuff. You know where this is posted? Uh, please don't. <laughs> please don't say anything. But yeah. I created a character I created for for a fan fiction really. Some more of those characters. Uh, one night was very um. How do I say? I couldn't sleep, so I made a hundred head kind of thing. I didn't do a hundred heads. I think I got up to nine. Yeah, nine. Some more Alistair. Swatches, an abandoned drawing. Lizards. Some more. Because I really like the male design I did for a demon. He doesn't have a name. He's just known as the demon man. Demon boy. Rose and the doctor. Tenth doctor stuff. An old drawing. I just found it and stuck it in. And then I redrew it kind of thing. as just David. Something. Now this. As you saw probably on this side. This was the design process for making a print for my demon character. And as you can see I do lots of note taking stuff and then ideas of what kind of other prints I could have made. Um, his human form and demon form. Ideas for a possible animatic. And then trying again with the sticker that I made of the titch streamer. Redesigning my female character, working out for printing stuff because I was getting a new printer at the time. Uh, fix up the saturation on this one and. Um, yeah, so redid the print on this guy, changed the colours on these ones so it was more vibrant, tried it on normal paper, didn't really work out very well. This is when I got my Hemi gouache, did a few landscape stuff. And I attempted an actual portrait. Didn't really like it in a bigger version, but I really like the smaller one. Some more scapes. Uh, pen sketches, Lowy Lane. She's a um, YouTuber who does scary stories and mystery stuff. Uh, this person, I don't know who she is, but in one of her videos, so I drew her. And a Pokemon character. Can't remember his name. I think it's bunny or something like that. Something like that. 
demon character based off of the Black Veil Bride's Red Cross, I think. Yeah. Cold weather stuff, because I like cold weather. And that is the cover up of the first try on these in gouache. Um, I have the original was sent out to the person that um, that I did this for. So I was making prints out of, out of the scans that I had. Dental appointment that I had and a little drawing of my dog who unfortunately passed away. A doctor dentist kind of character that I created. I love stuff. Um, can use it if you want. <laughs> Um, some scape stuff, another character I was randomly making up, more of that character, his house, his bedroom, stickers, with my old, um, compute, with my old printer, which left lines on them, uh, tried it with glossy paper and that's how they turned out, my brother's cat Nacho, my cat Chester, Killer bartender that I created, corpse, some other stuff on tone paper, and then that's the photograph with photo paper of the finished products with gouache. Purple guy, my characters in this sketchbook that I drew. So now obviously, when this episode came out. more stuff from Pinterest. This is going to go by really quick because I'm honestly not feeling it. It's not my favourite sketchbook but yeah, some Loki stuff that eventually got turned into a sticker but that was the original sketch. It was meant to be Natasha Romanoff and Steve Rogers. They don't look like them but oh well. That's what they looked like in the end. And then when I was doing a paper print of Loki or paper prints of Loki. Just a boring page. This is my sticker study stuff. That was into a sticker. This is the Ragnarok um, Loki. I'm messing around. And then I made one that's a lot bigger. Thor in Ragnarok. Some clothing stuff. Um, inspired by... Um, and with some of her own work of, um, put the name somewhere around here of who the person is. I'll also link their Instagram and their, um, YouTube channel as well. But I really like their art. I think it's like Serif Sarah or something like that. That other page that I had, but I just put it on an actual proper marker paper. Notes doing some watercolour stuff on watercolour paper. I really liked it. And then I drew Tom Hiddleston. First time doing a portrait on a watercolour and it turned out really nice. I still like it. And then I did some doodles because it took forever. Uh, my design stuff for my cat stickers. That's the... I believe that's the proper size of them. And then I had these little baggies if I were to sell them and whatnot. Some more prints of Tom Hiddleston playing with the saturation and contrast. Uh, dresses. Some more stuff. My boyfriend gave me his hoodie. Gouache stuff. I think that was meant to be William Herndale or an attempt of William Herndale. Cat that I found on Pinterest and I tried painting it without guidelines or anything like that. An abstract cat blue because I wanted to do something and then I just drew that. Designed for that um what's his name? Um I don't know, one of the Pokemons, I can't remember. I'm not a Pokemon fan. I like the show, but I'm not a fanatic. Um Toucan. My character Kieran. My prince character who does magic. Some more play with Kieran. 
Sorry, Eric. Sorry, Eric. Kieran is a different character. Pokemon stuff. Fairies. Uh, as you can see, they were cut out from old sketchbooks that I had. Just random. Frog and then person. Some more scribbles and then eventually a drew bat and then a uh, sphinx cat without eyes that I saw on Pinterest and I thought it was adorable. And then here are more stickers and a bingus stinker. And then this is the stuff that I got for the next sketchbook, which is the Zeta series. And then in here, it's not much really, it's just a bigger one of this, of Loki. Piece of paper, blank, Ahsoka, uh, stickers if they were packaged all together, and that's all there is on that one. So, that was the sketchbook. It's not my favourite. Uh, I wasn't a huge fan of the, the ILO sketchbook, to be honest, just because it was just, eh, it wasn't worth the price, really. It really wasn't. I mean, Maybe people like it, I don't know, but me personally it just didn't work for me. I'm not going in. I have to do that. It just wasn't for me, that's all. But uh that's the end of that sketchbook. And I'll see you in the next one.